Well, there is good news if you're hunting for an apartment in San Diego. And big changes for two well-known local companies. Our business editor, Andrew Kleski with the North County Times, joins us now with a look at that. Andrew. Good good and, we, and we put quotes around that good news because <laughs> we're not exactly sure yet. But the San Diego apartment hun uh, hunters may be getting a break that they haven't seen in years. According to the San Diego County Apartment Association, the local apartment vacancy rate almost doubled this year thanks to a sluggish economy and so many military deployments. The 4.5% vacancy rate this quarter is about 80% higher than last year's 2.5%, with the most openings being seen in areas such as Oceanside and Mira Mesa, where a lot of military families live. But before you go out there and tell your landlord to take a hike, you might note that a 4.5% vacancy rate is still pretty low. And with the military returning from overseas, this may just be a statistical blimp. And two well-known San Diego companies came under new ownership this week, one gaining and one shedding big company partners. First up, the San Diego home improvement chain Dixie Nine Lumber came, uh, will now belong to a Redmond, Washington-based construction supply company called Lenoga Corp. Dixie Line will use Lenoga's strength to begin expanding outside San Diego County. And going in the other direction, San Diego-based Bumblebee Seafoods has left the big ConAgra Foods conglomerate and now belongs to a partnership made up of company executives. The $500 million company plans to keep Bumblebee headquarters in San Diego and grow staffing here as it acquires other seafood-related firms. And there's way too much on the investment calendar next week as we'll have the latest on consumer confidence, new and existing home sales, durable goods orders, the first quarter gross domestic product report, and the latest on personal income and spending. And on the local calendar on Tuesday, the Downtown Residential Marketing Alliance hosts a series of seminars on living downtown, and that'll be at the Downtown Information Center. On Wednesday, LEED San Diego presents its 2003 San Diego Visionary Awards, and that'll be at the San Diego Hall of Champions in Balboa Park. And on Thursday, the Asia Desk of the San Diego World Trade Center holds its Trade Visions 2003 event at the Joan B. Kroc Institute for Peace and Justice. And as I say every week, if you'd like to see your calendar item up there, please send it to me, care of 10 news, or email me at the North County Times at Kleski at nctimes.com. And as I say, don't tell your landlord to take a hike just yet. Let's, <laughs> let's see what happens when so all you these... mentioned it was a blip possibly right now. That's what we're thinking it could be. It could be just a blip because all these guys left and they're all coming home right mm -hmm. now and you know they're going to be hunting for a place to live and there just isn't that much available. And the prices are relatively holding steady. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, right. Andrew. Thank Thanks, you. Andrew. A list